But Jay, there was a lot of talk in the press conference that we just left about kind of being prepared for this whole scene, um, what it's like, all these fans, all this attention. How do you think your team will handle this situation? You never know until you're in it. Uh, I feel very comfortable at how they've approached everything that's been put in front of them to this point. So I think they understand the importance of preparation, um, anticipating, visualizing what it's going to be like, and then um, utilizing that to help us you know, settle into the game and uh, really uh, look to play our best. I think uh, getting off to a good start is important, and um, we've done that a lot this year, so I'm looking forward to getting out there. Yeah, having played in front of all those fans in Starkville, smaller but very vocal crowds in Lafayette, do you feel like those experiences will will carry you into this situation and will help you to deal with whatever distractions or noise or whatever is out there? Well, I think it helps, for sure. Um, I think it's, it's fair for us to understand that it's the College World Series, and in these guys' minds, this is what they've worked for their entire life. It's why a lot of them chose to come to Arizona. And, you know, their heart's going to be beaten a little bit, and that's okay. And we'll work hard over the next 24 hours to help them manage that and work through that. And I have great confidence that they'll be able to do that because, like I said, they've met every challenge that's been put in front of them. Give the fans back in Tucson a quick scouting report of the Miami Hurricanes. Well, when you watch them on tape, it sometimes looks like you're watching Miami football and Ray Lewis is playing linebacker and Michael Irvin's at receiver. Um, it's great offense, one through nine. Every guy can hurt you with speed and power, solid hitting skills throughout the lineup. Metavila is one of the best pitchers in the country, um, has four pitches for strikes. Uh, really good command with this fastball and they're the number one fielding team in the country so uh, very good team and uh, we're looking forward to a great opportunity tomorrow night. Sure and the last thing I wanted to ask you some fans have been asking me and I've wondered this myself how come you guys don't throw the ball around after you strike out a ball? It's a great question um, that's one of uh, our deals is to keep the momentum of the game in our dugout it's to speed the game up when we're on defense because we really try to slow it down when we're on offense. So it's just to give our pitcher a little bit more rhythm and um, get him off the field as quick as we can.